Douglas Thomas is sitting behind bars for a crime he committed back in 1992. See, that guy had a chance to live his entire life. Thomas was a truck driver back in 92 when he picked up sex worker Shinda Denise Hayes. He murdered her and dropped her body at a truck stop on I-30 in Titus County. He strangled her and he drove her to Texarkana and they said where she was possibly sex assaulted after being killed. Dumped there with no clothes on, nude body. Her aunt went 30 years with no answers until she got a phone call in 2022. DNA had linked Thomas to Hayes' murder. What was that like when you got the phone call from them saying they had their man? I told them, are you sure? <laughs> After 30 years, are you sure? Yeah. And uh, they said, most definitely. We got the right one. The, it was a Texas Ranger who actually went out and met with him. And Mr. Thomas gave his DNA, no, I don't think realizing what it was really going to connect him to. Thomas was sentenced in McLennan County this week after pleading guilty to killing Hayes. A sentencing where Hayes' aunt tried to give a victim impact statement. He didn't care about what I had to say. None of it. So I just let it go. He's also accused of killing Sherry Herrera, a California mother of four and a sex worker in March of 1993. He was a truck driver for over 40 years. There is a possibility that there are more victims. And if there are, I hope that um, one day those are solved as well. In addition to all of this, Hayes' aunt tells me Hayes gave birth before her murder and wonders where that daughter is now. She believes she may be living in Waco and has a message for her. Her family's here. Door's open. We would like to know if, if anybody knows the whereabouts of me. I just want to know where she is and if she exists so she could be a part of our family.